Hello everyone, and welcome to the sixth episode of our Stalker Gamma Ecologist run. So last time we were in the Great Swamp and um, actually managed to grab a few stashes around here. We did a few missions. Unfortunately, we did lose Professor Semenov, never did manage to get the data on the five different mutants. And then he decided to um, off himself by running right into our field of fire while we were killing a few renegades um, right at the doctor's uh, hideout. Renegades don't usually pull from their base to the hideout, but this uh, this was weird. They just attacked us in there. We ended up without ammo, so we had to take a couple of them with, uh, with the knife. But we did manage to get out only to die a little bit later on the way home. But we recovered everything. And we did finish the mission for the doctor. And the next thing we have to do is go into the Agroprom underground to look for Strelok's hideout. But um, I'm, I'm kind of scared to do that with the gear we have right now. We did get a better armor, but we are still pretty doing pretty bad with um, ammo. We have an AK-103, unfortunately, we do not have the parts to fix it. It's got a very good barrel, but we still need to find the bolt and the trigger mechanism. And um, yeah, we should start moving towards that city where we can actually set up a base there. So that's what I am going to start with today. And then after we uh, finish setting up there, I will want to head over to wild territory. And I think with the new armor that we have, which is, uh, oh, got the buttons mixed up, which is the Voyager stalker suit. Yes, I know it's not an ecologist suit, but uh, it, does say in the description that it was intended for exploration of the zone. So, yeah, we're, we're gonna use this one. It's much better than our leather jacket. We found it in a stash, so it doesn't break any of the rules we set up for ourselves. And uh, I, I think that will be enough to do the um, anomalies that we have to do in the wild territory. We also have a yellow stash here that we should be able to get, although it is in the very, very radioactive uh, uh, building right here. And there's also a stash full of documents for Kai that uh, might as well pick up. There also, there's also some markers on the map that says uh, stash with our items. These are stashes uh, that were marked because we died. Unfortunately, I think they're gonna stay there. I think it's a little bug that comes with the Souls-like um, game mode. We died with... Um, we died a couple of times without any items on us, except what we got from waking up. And uh, it did mark a stash where we could get our items back, but there's nothing to get. Also, apparently, if we die with... Um, mission objectives on us. We also get the original stash marked up, but um, yeah, they, they just aren't there. So we do have the items, but apparently um, the game still thinks they're in the stash. Right, well, with all that said, there's another stash here, but um, yeah, I don't think we can get in here right now. Uh, it would uh, require us passing very close to Laboratory X-16, and we don't have a Psy Helmet. There's another yellow stash in the garbage, which we could pick up later after we come back from Walter. So, again, Dead City will uh, come out, we'll come back out to the Antar, go to Wild Territory, do what we have to do there, Maybe pass through Rostock, uh, get some missions, move down to garbage once again, and uh, grab the couple of stashes we've got, and then 
go back and talk to the scientist that gave us the mission to hunt for the anomalies, which I think is right here in you. Right, while I was talking, we got hungry and thirsty and are not doing on food. Uh, let's see how we're doing on room. All right, we have some. So first thing, we actually go to um, our friend here that actually that sells um, food, and we can buy some chunka. Yeah, I'll buy a couple of these just to have for the road. Other than that, uh, we're doing very bad. Actually, no, we, we did manage to get some meds, so we can take a couple of hits. Um, hopefully, we... You know what? I'll sell that, dude. I'll sell the vodka as well. Okay, but we're still very low on ammo, and uh, unfortunately, can't really buy anything from because there is no trader that sells ammo in part of um, in this part of the game. Well, in Yantar, I mean. Okay, what else? I should probably buy a weapon. Fair thing, just to get my MP5 up a little, two percent. Right, so. Let us get our stuff and Dead City. Which is an interesting place you guys picked up. Dead City got marks. And uh have any here that Dead City's got mercs and mercs don't really give um give a lot of assassination missions, but not a lot of missions that so we'll see what happens, I guess. Um, do else that we just sell? Hmm. And the artifacts are pretty heavy, so I might as well leave them here, and I'll pick them up at a later date. What else? We're still a bit overweight. I would like to drop a few more um, grams. We can. The gun here and the A. That's alright. We'll, we'll pick them up next time. Okay. Um, oh, we do have the main mission of meeting with Dushman. Uh, which is perfect. It's in the way. So let's see. Got ahead. Oh yeah, let's let's also check the task board. Maybe we got some new yesterday. <laughs> this is perfect. Yeah, we we can go there. Or these. Uh, but we're gonna have to here. We'll have 30 rounds of HP ammo, which is not a lot. So hopefully we won't counter anything uh, on the way, because we simply don't have the ammo to. Do. And there's the screen, uh, the screen turning, um, our vision turning, uh, a bit of a. Uh, Sepia collar. Oh, that's a burner right there. And a lot of radiation. Let's just turn this in really fast and get out of here. Yeah, this armor is better than what we had, but it still doesn't give us a lot of radiation. Which has been our biggest problem until now. And it's still going up. Oh. Come on, get out of rats. You know what, I'll use a medkit right now. 
simply because there will be mutants up here, I, I think. I, I don't like to have a full stamina bar before I start the uh, up. Yeah, there's a snork. I can hear another one, right? Okay. That, that one dropped these. I'm trying to keep my ears out if there are any. I don't. Orcs can get really quiet when they want to. Okay, pseudo dogs. We we run. I can hear them over there, but I don't see them coming over. Best case scenario would be pulling them over to the the bunker. Another thing we could just try and make a run for it. The dogs are much faster than me. Are. Okay, we run. Okay, there's an anomaly between me and... Oh, perfect! Right, let's let's just keep going. I don't want to take the chance of fighting them right now. Exit should be right around here. Yes! Okay, here we are, dead city. Now this spot is not very uh, fun to be in. Because sometimes I have some pretty angry me spawning around this area. Those are just zombies. Don't actually have any pistol ammo. But uh, I've, I've come through this area a lot of times only find myself face to face with uh, chimeras, controllers. But we're just gonna make... And the fracture, oh great. We're on the other side of the thing. Okay. I wouldn't mind pulling them all the way to the Merc base. <laughs> okay, uh, some bees, get rid of brads. Okay, that was actually not bad. And here we are, our new home. So, first thing, I'm gonna set up my stuff up here. Right in the area. My favorite place to make a home when I'm playing mercenaries. But we will need for sure. And first things first, 
we need a portable workshop. I will check out uh, the other player as well in time. But for now, this is a must because uh, it allows you to actually work from the workshop by putting items in. All right, and we're going to drop everything here that we don't. That includes the vodka, which I actually should have turned in for some bullets. Right, that's that's pretty cool. We have our uh, a nice little setup here. Um, drop anything else is pretty heavy and I'm not really using it. Other than that, I pretty much need everything. Okay, um, work base. I can have a little chat with Aslan and uh, ask him about um, the faction patches lottery. We don't have any patches right now, but uh, it's, it's good to have it written down. Uh, we have some water, we have food, that's okay, and uh, we're gonna do a little bit of a loop run. Uh, oh. I'm gonna show off like that, I guess. So, usually there's not much around here. Oh, they're fighting the fracture. Oh, two fractures. And it looks like they managed to kill a Merc. So we might actually get some free loot out of that. Oh, and there's dogs coming in too. The shotgun guy will close. Be. Okay. Um, I'm listening, man. There is one thing I want to do first, and that is I want to head up here. This guy has a guitar, and usually he also has some meds here. Not the best stuff, but uh, better than nothing. And I hear another dog. Are they still fighting over there? They're still fighting over there. Uh, one of the other mercs might have died, so I'm gonna do a quick run all the way there and see what I can scrounge off of those uh, those guys. Ooh. Ooh, some meds. One of the fractureds died in uh, a toxic anomaly. Okay. This is all amazing. I love it. I'll take it. Oh, morphine. That's also great. And the other Merc died somewhere around here. There he is. Oh, Remington. And a grenade, which is amazing. Okay. Uh, we looked at the fracture. Other fractures right here. I'm not sure if I can get to it. Yes. Oh, wow. That's that's an actual gas stove. That's that's a me. Okay, there's another merc there fighting something. I'm gonna go there only see uh I can off of what he killed. Zombies! Right, this gas sto stove is amazing. We can, uh, if we get some, um, what do you call it? It's that fuel thing. Uh, <laughs> if we get some good fuel, we could actually cook some amazing. 
yeah unfortunately the merc went into the house of culture and we can't get in there it's pretty high on psychic damage and we we can't really get in there right now but i think we got some pretty loot out of all of this There's some dogs in the distance. Very dark with the shader setup that I have right now. Okay, let's let's have a talk with Doom. I have come to see you. I have a job for you. A certain faction has moved in on an area that our client would prefer they not be and they need to be removed. You must go alone. They are prepared for a large assault, but they will not be expecting a lone infiltrator. Sneak into their camp and eliminate as many of them as you can. Okay, normally I would not do this, but it is a main mission that comes from the scientists, so I can't really avoid it. Also, we did say we'll make an exception for dealing with monolith, right? Okay, I'm gonna sell the guitar here. And, uh... Whatever, whatever else I can't sell to a mechanic, I'll sell to this guy. Glow sticks... How's your family doing? I think that's it. Ow. Yeah, I, I don't see that I could sell. To him, we can actually sell the bedspread, the torquelin, and the um, alpin hammer, which I don't need at this moment. Would be nice to keep, but uh, yeah, right now, money is more important for us. Even this little bit. Okay, um, so we, we buy, um, buy ammo. I have something else that I could sell for much. Another 100. Yeah, sure. Sell the Magnum Rock. Okay, Hunter's Kit is actually pretty cheap, though I think it will be cheaper in uh, Garbage uh, from Butcher. Okay, uh, what weapons? So basically, any cheap weapon. My pistol considered a cheap weapon? No, the MP5 is a cheap weapon, of course. Right, I don't think there's anything else to loot here. So let's check on our missions. Spring cleaning. This is actually pretty fun. It's uh, going around the dead city area and hunt mutants. So we'll take that one and I'll even try to do it right now. We have a little bit of ammo. Scouting expedition is basically camp assault. So we're not doing it. Contract killers, we're not doing it. And um, all the others, but I will take that um, basic option. I mirror horn. That would be. All right. Tell me what you know. Okay. So that's that's all we can do around here. I love how this mission actually has a black chimera face in the thumbnail. Um, it's it's very encouraging. Okay, we can also search this dash here. As for monolith, ah, uh, where is this? It's in the house right below the bridge in in Limansk. Um, so that would mean dealing with like uh, maybe ten monolith guys. We're we're not gonna do that mission for a little while.
Okay, let's drop the other stuff we have that we're not using, which is um, this armor kit, uh, the gas stove. And all of these. Okay, if we had a few more meds, I'd say we were good. But we... And I don't really want to sell any. And we are going to go to garbage, so I could take at least um, some of the stuff here. Like, just, just skim a bit, a bit off the top. But we'll do that when we come back. Let's, let's try and... First of all, I'm going to set my spawn point right here. Our new house. And um, I am going to try to... Do the, um, I'm listening, man. Bring cleaning. Let's see if anyone here wants... Actually... If they will, they will want to join us for money, as works. But it never hurts to to try. Also, a few of their guys already died to um fractures and dogs. Hmm. Okay, there's one more patrolling over there. Yeah, they they want cash. I'm gonna have to build a little bit of trust with them. they're gonna uh, help me out. So I uh, hear zombies to the right. That's not a very big problem. Ooh, there are some bullets over there. Can I pick them up? Hey, that's that's not bad. Not sure how many there are. Eight bullets. That's that's not bad. It'll it'll get us a couple hundred, I guess. Trying to listen to what kind of music we're gonna meet um, up there. Oh! Okay, that is a problem. Properly from here. Wow, wow, wow. It, we, we need a better spot. Okay. We managed to cheese that fight a little bit, but um, it was a controller, and uh, fortunately, didn't drop any controller parts. Where's the next one? It's gonna be in the houses uh, south here. I was hearing some dogs in that area.
Something's coming. I could have probably done it with your bullets used, but uh, I don't really want to take that chance. We're doing much worse on meds than we are on bullets. And I'm not even sure the dogs were the priority to pull for the spring cleaning mission. So, uh, what if... Oh! Apparently they died. I'm guessing they walked into an anomaly or something. And then there's the other mutants that... The other merc was fighting at the House of Culture. How do we... Because I can't enter the House of Culture, just like I said. That looks like a Psy Sucker to me. Luckily, we do have the map... Um, we do have the mini-map to where he is. I, I meant to jump over that. Luckily, it didn't hurt much. Woo! That's a chimera. Okay. <laughs> oh, did you just see? Do you do you see what I see? Oh, jackpot! <laughs> Look at this beauty. It's a pristine chimera hide. What the hell are you guys fighting? I need to see what the Oh! It's a dog. Right, so coming back to this. I do need to take... Um, you know what, I'll take a Yadolin and I'll, I'll just uh, suffer through the dizziness. But yeah, 99% Chimera hide. That's that's insane luck. Insane. 20% stamina recovery. We won't have problems with stamina ever again. 20% rupture. 9% ballistic. And look at that weight carried. That is incredible. Plus a chimera heart. And a claw. Wow. <laughs> Wow. Right, unfortunately, we are completely out of bullets. Only we still have a little bit of FMG. So, there's still some mutants over there. But first, I think I'm gonna go check on that stash. Maybe we can sell something from it. I wouldn't really want to sell the Chimera Heart and the Chimera Claw yet. Because it could um, it could give much better rewards from a mission. Okay, this is where the fractures were. This actually reminds me. Check 
Not this one, but this. There might be something here too. But the other building right in front of this one. Uh, I think it was a store of some sort. And it usually does have some things left. Um, yeah, there we go. But always check this store. Because it, it can have, have some some just a lot of stuff on the um, on the shelves left over. It's a lot of ammo. Well, not a lot, a little bit of ammo, but we can sell that and uh, try and get some of ours. So, let's check that building. Uh, rad resist, rad resist, rad resist. Do we not actually have anything for rad resist? Oh, I, I was already removing rats from, from that one. Um, oh well. We do have some vodka at home. Yeah, I'll I'll go take the vodka. Or you know what? Let's just uh leave this stash for later. Uh could fix up our armor right now. A little bit. Ooh, wow. Let's let's get those boars activated. I just wanna pull aggro on them a little bit. That guy's gonna die. And we're gonna pull them back all the way to the Merc base. Um, or maybe he'll live and we get some boar parts? Ah, uh, boars aren't what they used to be. Oh, it's just zombies. Um, actually, I think these are the mutants we are supposed to deal with. And if this guy does it for us, even better. Didn't even have to use ammo, and they have some bandages. Or they didn't drop a lot of ruble. I think it one ruble each on that stack. There is someone else fighting to the north. I think this will be the last part of the mission. And I did hear a roar, either it was a chimera or a pseudo giant. Oh, it's just zombies. Uh, I guess one... I guess that guy's gun sounded like something? Perfect. We got some Etprazine. And actually, these guys died. I've never seen this weapon before. I mean, I've seen G36 and G36Ks. Never in an RMR. Uh, unfortunately, we can't pick these up. But we can take everything else. Perfect. Okay. There's one more mutant thing to deal with. Let's go on the other side. And I have no idea what it's gonna be. It 
sounds like it's just more zombies. Because if it's anything bigger, um, the amount of ammo I have... Yeah, just zombies. Yeah, that was not the best use of my ammo. I think all I have left is AP now. Okay, finally, we're, we're done with this. And if I remember right, this should give us a pretty tidy amount of... Pretty tidy sum of money? You know what I mean. Oh, did do this? Didn't? There's more. Oh my god. Um, I'm completely out of money. Let's see what we can sell. What's up, bro? Definitely get rid of the suppressor. Um, now that's right. I'm gonna. S no, I don't want. Art. Okay, I f that's it for now, and um, okay, so we're gonna have to finish this mission with only one magazine of HP ammo in an MP5 and three AP bullets, <laughs> and uh, yeah, those are dogs over there. I'm just wasting but Okay, are we done now? Yes, we are finally done with this mission. be upstairs. Job is done. Okay, that's 6,000 rupees. And of course, I'm just gonna have to buy even more ammo with Even though we're completely out of meds. No, meds first, ammo later. What?
afford any of these. Okay. Got it. So, um... Yeah, I'm, I'm not sure what to do at this point. Going to wild territory with ammo we have on us right now doesn't really like a good idea. Um... Don't really have anything better. Now uh, we didn't we get any missions that we can right now. What's up, bro? Um, there's no one to sell us bullets. Well, get there. Hmm. Ah, this, this is quite annoying, so I think I might actually have to sell some, uh, something. <laughs> oh wait, never mind. Uh, we're gonna have to go through, um... We're gonna have to go through, uh... Um... Sorry, I'm having a brain not work moment. <laughs> we're gonna have to go back through Yantar. And uh, I think we can trade in that vodka for um, for actual parts. Oh, there we go. That's that's gonna be some money. We're not gonna make our own meds, honestly. I think it, we're better off just giving this to a uh, surgeon. Four thousand. Yeah, that's gonna be enough for like another another magazine. <laughs> Eight hundred rubles. Um ah, we're we're okay. Okay, let's let's go through to wild territory, and I'll still take the vodka, and I'll still try and trade it on dark. So we gotta go south to here. Alternatively, we could go could go through um, army warehouses, maybe pick up some missions there as well. Ah, let's let's go through Yantar. We have the vodka. We can uh, get some more bullets from there, and I think that should be it. Now we have two more matches left, so um, the. Water cures some radiation, so let's have a drink of water. Oh, this is so beautiful. Fields of gold. But I heard something. it should be right there between the pillars of the fence. Okay, back in Yantar. Um, might still have to deal with mutants over here. That's not a very good thought. Yep, dogs. Well, that solves the issue, doesn't it? <laughs> There's actually an artifact there. it. 
Oh crap. All the way back. Yeah. Because I took so much damage, I actually pressed the button for the uh, blue med kit, completely forgetting that I don't have a blue med kit. Uh, yeah, it's it's all on me. We're gonna have to go pick that back up. That, that was so stupid. Well, it is what it is. Let's go back out there at night. Because uh, nothing can happen, right? Of course, they want money. Let's do this. Let's see how it turns out. If there's any interest around here, I'm gonna try and pull way back to the base. Okay, luckily we still have a 38 round, so that's good. anomalies and then we can just run along the fence hopefully it's just hopefully we won't meet on the way I definitely heard something oh did I I passed it Are. I can already hear zombies somewhere around here and I'm just not ready for it, so I'm gonna run. Fortunately I still need to get my staff from here. So um uh, Pre-med. Oh. Oh. Okay, luckily it died right there. I still need to get everything. Take it all and uh, artifact. Perfect. And we can uh there are everything back. And where did I put the there. Yeah, I know I'm hearing things, but it's just um It's just the uh, the side damage I took. I will definitely another med kit charge. I'm pretty sure something will be waiting for us, but um, I I can't risk waiting. We're gonna go straight to the bunker right now. But yeah, I still have to learn when and when to and when not to get into anomalies 
and uh, we're still not ready. Some of them, but we're back in the base. Слушаю тебя. Have here. Ah, we're still pretty artifacts. Okay, uh, our armor took some damage. I can put the backpack on. We did get a scar, and I'm gonna turn around and sell it right now. Right. Perfect. This this actually got us a little bit of money. Okay, and we are definitely going to need to get some meds. Okay, we can sell stuff here. Perfect. Right, this is what we're going to go to the wild territory with. I'm going to reset the spawn here, and we will do this at night. But for now, uh, we are out of time, so we'll end the episode right here. So for a quick recap, we got all our stuff, that city. We watched some mercs get killed, we did everything off of them. We built, uh, we built our new stash, we put everything in there. We finished the spring cleaning missions in uh, the dead city, which was pretty cool. And now we are back in Yantar. We died again. I'm I'm still learning how to deal with anomalies properly. I'm not used to dealing so early in the game. But uh, we'll we'll learn, and uh, you'll learn alongside me, apparently. <laughs> and uh, next episode we will head over to Wild Territory. We have a couple of missions. We have some stashes, and uh, we will have to go to. Anomalies, uh, one under the bridge and one at the electric train. And we will get the artifacts for the scientists, after which we will go back. Um, we will go to Rostock, finish some missions there, get some more. And that's gonna be it. So, if you enjoyed this, uh, this episode and uh, our stalker runs, please don't forget to leave a like. Uh, subscribe and of course uh, drop a comment with anything you'd like to see or uh, any comment you have on this episode. So yeah, that'll be it for today and as always I'll see you all next time.